if your phone fails to find the Mi Band, tap here on Add Model, and then scroll down to Xiaomi Smart Band 8, and tap here. Tap on Sign In. And now you have an option to sign in. You can create account here, or you can sign in via SMS. I'm going to use that method because it's it's the simplest. Okay, so now that I have registered, I am back on this page. So I'm going to choose here. Again, show me Smartband 8. Okay, so if you find yourself in a situation where you cannot connect your Mi Band with your phone, the problem is with the region set in the phone because uh, some of these Mi Bands are set to be connected only to the Chinese region, not to other regions. So this is why you're getting rejected. So let me show you how to fix that problem. Uh, to fix that problem, Go to the profile, then go to the settings, and here tap on region. Look for China. Here it is. And tap on China. Continue. And once you tap on China, the app is going to start from the start. This is fine. And by the way, region is not relevant at all. This is just for them to know uh, from where are you using the Mi Band, it really, it's not that relevant. So let's tap on start, check the first check as before, agree. Now tap on the devices, add device. Now, second time, it's not going to work probably neither. So what you need to do is simply just to close the app and then open it again. Now when you close and open the app again, go to the devices, tap on plus, and here it is. Tap on it. Now, if your pairing fails again, there are a few other things you can do. So the first thing we want to do is to close the app. Then here, go to the reset. Tap on reset and then tap on check. The next, you're going to go to the Bluetooth and make sure that your Bluetooth is off. So turn it off. Wait a little bit and then turn it on. Now open the app again. Tap on the device. Choose English here. And now tap on a device. Tap on the device when you see it. And then tap on the check here. Yeah, and that's pretty much it. Now we are paired, but we'll have to do a few steps here. This video is brought to you by Stanley Quencher H2.0 the ultimate companion for every adventure. Experience the perfect blend of style, durability and functionality with the Stanley Quencher H2.0 Flow State Tumblr. No matter where life takes you, it keeps your drinks just the way you like them. For more information, check out the link in the video description below. Then here tap on Next, Next, Done. Now here you have two options. First one is checked. That means that each app install on this phone is going to send the notifications on the fitness band obviously we don't want that so tap here so we can select from which one we want the notifications then tap on set we have to turn on notifications so we need to allow this me fitness app to send the notifications to the me band so tap on set here is the app so allow it again allow now that this is allowed, go back. And here you have a list of your apps. So you can choose from which apps would you like to get notifications. So I'm going to choose WhatsApp here. Got it. Done. This is again something that you definitely want to set. So I would advise you to tap on set here and allow it. Allow it again. Hello. Uh, sync DND. DND stands for don't disturb so once you set your phone on don't disturb the phone will automatically set your fitness band on don't disturb so again tap here on set if you get this message definitely tap on continue tap on download anytime you get any updates always install them all right and that's pretty much it thank you guys for watching if you have any questions please leave them in the comment box below again thanks for watching have a nice day and see you in the next one. Bye-bye.